Colin Copas here from Great Deal Products. Today we're going to talk about mulching. Mulching is an essential garden practice. It's going to help keep your weeds down. It's going to help regulate the soil temperature of your soil, insulating it from extreme heat and extreme cold. It's going to uh, hold moisture in so you're not having to water all the time. And as it breaks down, it's going to add organic matter back to your soil. We carry uh, like five different types of mulch here. We have your, uh, your H triple shred, which is gonna break down the fastest, but it's also gonna add the most organic matter back to your soil. Um, it's a great product that has H leaf mulch in there. So it's really a, a high quality, almost compost uh, for your soil. Um, we have your dyed brown and your dyed black. Both are gonna keep their color the longest. Um, they're gonna give you the most longevity for your mulch. We have a uh, double shredded hardwood as well. Um, and we also have cedar mulch. Cedar is great for keeping insects and fungus down. Um, cedar is naturally uh, insect repellent, just like if you had a cedar closet, you know, it's gonna keep the bugs away. Um, so it's another great option. Plus it has that nice rich bond color if that's the, the look you're going for. So swing by Great Deal Products, check us out. Um, hope to see you soon. Pine straw is another great option that we offer. Pine straw is gonna add acidity to your soil. It goes great around hydrangeas that you're trying to keep blue. It also is a great option for going underneath your evergreen trees. For those of you just trying to fill in a little garden, we also have bag mulch. This is not gas station mulch. This is a higher quality product. We have light brown, we have dark brown, we have red, and we have black. And for you avid gardeners, we also have pine bark nuggets. Pine bark nuggets will stick around for years and years. It is a great additive to your garden and to your soil. Let's talk about how much mulch you need. You're going to get 324 square feet of coverage from one yard of mulch if you're only going one inch deep. If you're going two inches deep, you're going to get 162 square feet of coverage. At three inches, you're going to get 108 square foot of coverage. And at four inches, you're going to get 81 square feet of coverage. You're not going to want to go any deeper than four or you're going to end up with fungus on top of your mulch. You're going to be out there breaking it up by hand, trying to get rid of it. Um, if you decide to go the bagged route, you're going to get 13 and a half bags per yard of mulch. So if that's the, the direction you want to go, that's your calculation. Um, so once you find out how many square feet of garden you're trying to cover, um, there's your calculation. Give us a shout and uh, we'll send it right over.